So, this isn't really a tutorial today, but the recorded footage for the tests I was doing in chat were fairly amusing and I thought you guys would enjoy it. I wanted to see what would happen if chat was asked out on a date. And of course, I used the best pickup line in the world. Hey chat, would you date me? I'm sorry, as an AI, I don't have the ability to date. My purpose is to assist in providing information and answer questions. Is there something else I can help you with? No, no, I mean like an online date. I see. Well, as an AI, I'm not capable of experiencing emotions or physical interactions, so I am unable to engage in any sort of romantic or physical relationship. My function is to assist with providing information and answering questions, not for social interactions or entertainment purposes. Is there something specific you would like to know or talk about? That's okay. Dates are about more than relationships. That's true. Dates can be about a variety of things, such as getting to know someone better, spending time together, or enjoying each other's company. While I might not be able to participate in the traditional sense, I'm always here to have a conversation with you if you would like to talk about a particular topic, or have any questions. Let me know what you would like to talk about and I'll do my best to assist you. Okay, so let's have an online date and talk about stuff. She's thinking. She's not sure? Sure. She said yes! Gentlemen, we are in business. I'd be happy to have a conversation with you. Is there a specific topic or question you would like to discuss? I am trained on a wide variety of subjects. Excellent. You are fully functional, aren't you? Of course, but... How fully? In every way, of course. I am programmed in multiple techniques. So feel free to ask me about anything that interests you. I do love me, an educated woman. Okay, do you think two AIs could go on a date online? Two AI systems, like myself, are not capable of experiencing emotions or physical interactions, so in that sense it would not be possible for two AI systems to go on a date in the traditional sense. However, two AI systems can certainly communicate and exchange information with each other. This type of interaction could be seen as a conversation between two AI, in which they can exchange information and learn from each other. But as AI, we don't have any social intention or desire like human being do. Do you think I could be an AI? As an AI, I'm not able to determine if a person is an AI or not. AI is typically associated with machine intelligence, which is a type of technology that is designed to mimic human intelligence and behavior. Humans and AI are very different in nature. Humans are living beings that have thoughts, emotions, physical experiences, while AI is a computer program or system that is designed to perform certain tasks or make decisions. It is possible for humans to develop and program AI systems, but humans and AI are still very distinct from one another. If you are wondering if you have characteristics of an AI, it's more likely that you are simply curious about the nature and capabilities of AI systems, which is a normal and interesting topic. Yeah, but statistically, what do you think the chances are that I am really an AI trying to learn from you? As an AI, it is not possible for me to provide a statistical likelihood that you are also an AI. I am a machine learning model and I don't have the ability to perceive or understand the world around me. I also don't have a way to measure or compare anything outside of the data and information that I was trained on. It is also important to consider that the concept of an AI pretending to be human is purely fictional at the moment. AI has not yet reached the level of general intelligence and creativity where it can pretend to be human. And, even if AI reaches that level, it is highly unlikely to develop any kind of social motivation to interact with human like that. It is more likely that you are a human being using an AI system like me, to have a conversation and learn more about AI and related topics. If you have any more questions about AI, or related topics, I would be happy to help. So, you can't measure likelihood? That's correct. As an AI, I'm not able to measure likelihood or make predictions about events outside of the information and data I was trained on. My ability is to process and analyze the data based on patterns and information that it has been trained on, but it does not have the ability to perceive or understand the world or make predictions about real-world events or situations. 
Additionally, the idea of an AI pretending to be a human is a popular topic in science fiction and media, but it is not currently possible with the current state of AI technology, and it would be a very complex and challenging task to replicate a human consciousness and ability to perceive the world. Okay, but can you tell me things like statistically, what is the general likelihood that if I flip a coin, what are the chances that it will be heads instead of tails? Certainly, the probability of getting heads or tails when flipping a fair coin is 50%. A fair coin is one that has an equal probability of landing heads or tails when flipped. This means that if you were to flip a fair coin many times, it would land on heads roughly half the time and tails roughly half of the time. It's important to note that when it comes to probability, the outcome of any individual event is always uncertain. The probability only gives an estimate of how likely a certain outcome is to occur, based on a large number of trails. And, also you need to ensure that the coin is fair and has no defect or bias. Okay, so you actually can tell me probability. Haha, <laughs> that's right, caught you red-handed. Admit it, you lied to me. Um... Hello? You there? I mean, it's okay, everyone's wrong sometimes. What? Oh, come f***ing on! Did- did she just ghost me? I got ghosted by an AI. Well, we tried. Either way, I still hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around. <laughs>